Hello everybody. I'm glad you all can make it. I'm going to do this is my display table right here. I'm going to be sitting here. My name is Rachel and I will be your consultant for today. So take a look at my display table real quick. So go ahead and just carefully look over it and I'll also show you some things. Okay, so like I said, my name is Rachel. I'll go ahead and write that down for you. This is the second class, so we are going to be learning blush and lips today. So, if you took the last class, it was more of the eyeshadow. Okay. And I don't know how many of you are here. What's your name? Okay, you were here for the last class, so... to go ahead and go over a little bit of what we're going to do today. So let me fill out this. So the first thing we're going to be looking up is blush. Okay. Everybody see? Okay, so this was a highly requested. I have um, a couple things to show you in regards to the blush. Um, you guys will be receiving, if I can find it. I'm a little disorganized, sorry guys. It's been a long day. Long makeup day. You'll be receiving your own blush brush. Okay? So as you can see, You just peel it open right here at the top and you'll be using this for your application. So yeah. And let me go ahead and we also have the color insider. This is an awesome book. Again, you can purchase this. And right here we have all the lipsticks. And you can choose, you get to choose one lipstick to take home today. So, we will be going over some looks to make it to the page. Okay. So, this is a very nice color combination. Let me get my glasses. So I can see this better. Okay. My reading glasses. Okay, so as you can see, it's beautiful. Lipstick color right there. Okay, this guide shows you. As you can see, take it off. It has the numbers. I hope you can see that. Okay, so. Number 9, 10, and 11 is your lipstick liner and lipstick. And then it tells you different 
face shapes for different blush to apply. I have all kinds of different skin tones. So we can match these very nicely. Okay. So let's go ahead and look at Vanessa here. She has more of a heart-shaped face, I would say. Not my square, sorry. She has a, more of a square face, okay? So your different face shapes, you do different things with your makeup. So, see she has a square face too. Miss Andrea. And we have Angie with an oval face. Oh. Cut. Very beautiful. And here's another oval. Miss Debbie. And Carrie has an oval too. Here's a heart shaped ring here. Miss Jessica with the heart shaped face, which it goes in smaller at the chin. Kind of like a heart. So those are all the different shapes. And then you have a round face too, but she has an oval. So we might be checking back in with this book for reference if we need to. If you would like to order this book, just let me know and I can get that ordered for you. I'm going to be giving you a lipstick sample for your lips and another one, a, a lip and a blush sample for today. So here you go. Let me go ahead and see. So, okay, we're going to do, we are going to do lips and blush today. So I'm going to go ahead and erase this. Going to work on blush application and lip color, color and liner. We don't have enough room to write that one. And it should keep us pretty busy. And we also have a third class, and at the end, you can sign up for that. Sorry for a second. Okay, so what we are going to do, since most of you attended the first class, to see how well you guys have done, I'm going to go ahead and set up a station for you, so that you can... Go ahead and apply what you've learned before. We also have this for our next class where we will be doing foundation. We will be testing you. Like, that is kind of your color, I think. So, yes. Okay. Okay, that there. So, first your station, we are going to give you a mirror. Now it just folds out like this, and then you tuck it like that, oops, sorry, and you're going to have this little slider, and we are going to slide in, go ahead and look for it first, sorry, I can get the bump. Okay. 
there we go. Now I'm going to give you your samples on here of everything. So let's go ahead and what blush did you have? I mean not blush, sorry, foundation. Okay, so you're this color. you liked. Right there. So you're just going to carefully bend this right here. This gets it open for you. And you're just going to pull it back. Okay. And the color is right there. I'm just going to set this here because it's much easier. As is. So I'm going to give you an extra pump of this to try. We can get it on. Okay. Oops. Here's your wand. And I'm going to get you your makeup brush. I'll get you a couple of these. Lay these out nicely. It's good to be organized. And that over there. Get you some more of these. Liners. Um here's a eyeliner if you want to take that. And then I have some sample eyeshadows. Probably, I'll probably give you more, maybe. So here's some blush and eyeshadows for you. I'm gonna put these on the right side, or the left, or whatever side. Okay, that should be good. and get started. Okay, so now that you have your um, makeup all on your palette, um, go ahead and do just one half of your face, and then I'm going to apply the other half to see how well it matches. You go ahead and do that while I get ready. Just use these um, applicators. You're 
I have better ones at home. Now, for the eyeshadow, we just did a simple look, so that's what I'm gonna do for you. Get my palette over here. Just gonna do a sample color, it's okay. Great. So you can finish up if you need to. So it looks like you pretty much know exactly what you're doing now. Yeah. Is it easier now? Because did you practice? It looks like you really did. So go ahead and look in the mirror for show you a couple things before we get started on the blush and the lips. I'm going to show you some of the perfume in our catalog so that you can order if you would like. And I'm going to go ahead and get it out for you. Here it is. And it's called Perfect. And it comes in this nice pattern and you reveal it like that. It's pretty cool. It's beautiful on the top. These rose color, this pink and this yellow in this face. Oops. I'm going to go ahead and spray a smell please. Right into the air and waft it your way. Okay, so that smells delicious. And I advise if you love this perfume to go ahead and buy it. We have 20% off. So that is like the best deal this week. And we also have this on sale 10%. I'm sorry, 15% off this. Satin Smoothie Hand Scrub. Okay, it comes with an adorable orange bag. And you get the cream, the lotion. Okay. And the other cream that goes along with it. Okay, and one more thing we have is our Highly. Highly, highly, highly reviewed makeup, remember? Okay, so it's 20% off as well. So these are very good deals. So I would uh, suggest you go after those. Those are samples, not samples, those are ready to go. You like, you really like that perfume. Okay, good. Well, I guess we can bag that up. 
can pay me at the end. First thing I'm going to show you on my laptop the diagram of the blush first and then when we do after that I'm going to go ahead and apply it to you and show you the book real quick too. So I wanted to show you the model that we did the class before real quick. So we did the lid right here, this light brown. We did the crease in a darker color, and then we did the highlight, which was a white, but I have it in yellow. And then we did a little bit of just the top eyeliner. Okay, just for a reference and to remember what we did. Now I'm going to bring up, I'm going to go ahead and bring up our first, and that would be our blush. Okay, here we go. See if you can see that. I'm gonna go ahead and move down a little bit. As you can see, we have the round face, the square face, and we have the oval, okay, and we have the heart shaped. So, with the round face, if you have a round face, it's um, advised to apply the cheek color to the apples of the cheek. So right there's the apples. For the square face, apply color to the apples of the cheeks. Keep attention on the center of the face. So right there and right there. So it doesn't look so square. Okay, it draws it in. So that's for a square. For the oval face, you can do quite a few things with the oval face. So you can apply cheek color along the cheekbones, so just down a little bit. Um, for a natural look, apply cheek color to the apples. So again, right here, these apples. So you're just gonna do it right there. And if you want a youthful look, apply cheek color slightly higher on the cheeks, just under the eye. So. About here, okay. So there you go. That's a good place to start. And our last one is the heart shaped face. Apply cheek color along the center of each cheek below the pupil of the eye to help the cheeks to appear thinner and the jaw wider. So about right here. The center below the pupils so it'll make the cheeks appear thinner and the jaw and the jaw wider okay. and there you go that's the heart shaped and I'm going to go ahead and Go ahead and you can apply it to your face shape. Like I said, there's different ways to apply the blush in different face shapes. So for you, you have it more right here. So let's go ahead and get your brush up. Okay. And some of that blush that you have. Okay, so I'm going to show you how I sweep this across. Okay, you see in the mirror? Down here? Yep, so go ahead and try that on the other side. Yeah, that's great. Yep, you see how it brings everything up. Yeah. 
that's pretty much the blush isn't too hard once you know your face shape you think you got that down pretty well okay let's go ahead and move on to the lips i have another diagram on my laptop okay here is the lip liner and lipstick diagram that i made so for your lip liner, shaping helps shape your lips any way you want. Just apply it around here. And it helps stop bleeding from the lipstick, so it keeps it, it's like a barrier. Um, endurance, and it helps it last longer. It helps it stick to the lip, okay. And the lipstick alternative, you can use the lip liner instead of lipstick if you would like. And then, of course, with your lips, we have all different colors ranging from blue to your gorgeous reds and your pinks. So that is what we can fill in the lips with. So many possibilities here. We are going to work on that, too. The hardest part, I think, is aligning. But with much practice, you'll get, you'll perfect it. You'll perfect it, and it won't be an issue. So, let's go ahead and try that out now. Okay. Okay, so... There we go. I'm gonna learn how to do that, so... I'll put this over here. Go ahead and get you a lining brush. So I got the lip liners. Here's yours. So I'm going to go ahead and show you. Just go around your lips like I showed you. Just hold still. Okay. So. You gotta take your time to get the nice shape. Okay, so I did that half. You can go ahead and do the other half. Right there. That looks great. You did a really good job. Okay, now you just fill in with lipstick. So now that we did, you can fill it in. You can even elongate it. So up. Okay, so there's your lip line and everything. Okay. It's kind of a lip, not the best lip, but see, there's the lip, and okay. right there, we're gonna go ahead and fill this in. And this section, you can do so many different things with this. You can ombre it. So put some light right here. Here. Make it darker in the, the outside, like that. Okay. So let's slip. Oops, right here. So there we go. There's multiple possibilities, and you can use your artistic capabilities to do whatever you would like. It's endless and it's fun, so you just gotta enjoy it. And if you can send your pictures to me if you like. So go ahead and fill in your lipstick. There's your brush, okay. That looks really good. You like that color? Yeah. I think that's a really good color on you. It's not too bright. <laughs> so you guys did a very good job today. Yeah. So I'm gonna send you home. You like that color? I'm gonna get that color actually. For you. Okay, I'm gonna that to your back. Yeah, 
And the other thing I want to add is we got a new catalog in today. Very excited about this one. Okay, so here's our new magazine. Okay. We have some new eye creams available on page five. So I um, highly re recommend you check this out. If you would like a free sample, I can put that in your bag too. And there's some more eye creams that I want to show you. And this right here that I showed you, that's on sale, isn't it? This is page 30. And they got some of the perfume in. Um, if you would like to start doing this, you can talk to me at the end. And we have exciting new colors. Okay, and raging from this beautiful purple and these beautiful blues. So please check this out on page 26. So, and look at this beautiful lip color. It's a new color. Pretty excited about it. It's called Granite Frost, Garnet Frost. And we have Sweet Raisin and pink sapphire so please give this a look and it's gonna have my card on it put my card in here and you can call me if you want anything ahead and give you that sample. So. Okay. Oh, and also I have a DVD for our first and second um classes. So if you forget, you can just pop this in and it'll teach you everything. It's all right here. So thank you for joining my class. And if you would like to attend the third one that we're going to be having in um, maybe January, December, um, I can write you down for that. I'm gonna go ahead and write you down since you're interested. Okay. Can I have your name and your. Here's your bag. I hope you enjoy this stuff. Um, your name and your phone number. sure it's going to be around the same time so I can look forward to that and it's I'm not sure exactly but I think we're going to cover at least some foundation materials or some other stuff and I'll actually send uh, I need your email send you the invite so you can get back to me and I'll also call you and you can call me and my cards in the bag if you need anything if you want to schedule a party if you want to order okay so thanks so much for coming it's really fun today go ahead and lock myself out I'm gonna go ahead and give you your bag and there you go. Thanks for coming. I'll see you guys next time.